Komoto here, welcoming you back to Let's Play Final Fantasy. This is a great idea. This is a submarine made from a barrel. We don't really have much of a choice, so we'll just have to put our faith in that Oxy Ale. Welcome to the Sunken Shrine. And here we have Sea Troll and Sea Scorpion. Uh, the majority of the enemies you'll run into here are weak to lightning, as you might expect. There are a couple enemies that are not, though. Oh, hey, an enemy that actually does something. It's also a new enemy, but... Yeah, not worth mentioning. Pocket change? Another new enemy. Basically running into a bunch of upgraded enemies you've already seen before. But we haven't seen a shark since earlier in the game. I'm going to have a lot of random battles here, aren't I? Here is the Sahagan Prince, the blue one in the background. Background's back line. That's a new enemy. Once again, not really an enemy worth mentioning, except for the fact that they are really fast. Put the gauntlets to use there to cast Thundera. And overkill. Because who doesn't love great bolts of lightning? Let's go over here first. Uh, that's right, there's nothing in there. This room contains a treasure box that only holds 20 gil. Oh, here's an enemy. The Water Elemental. They are not weak to lightning. They're weak to cold. I don't know why that is, it just is. But they're also decently powerful enemies. Here we get diamond armor. I thought that I'd get a lot of battles. And I'm not even on the path to the boss yet. Here we get a light axe. You can use that as an item in battle to cast Dyra. And this is a mage's staff, which can be used as an item in battle to cast Fira. And that's a lot of spare change. The fifth floor of the sunken shrine has mermaids and treasure. Pocket change, spare change, diamond armlet. Huh. 
<laughs> Everyone's uh, overreacting to how we're able to do these things. First it's Gaia, now it's mermaids. Yeah, there's no random battles on this floor, in case you haven't noticed. And the mermaids here are just begging for our help, mostly. Yeah, there's the uh, Mirage, Ch Mirage Tower, which is where we have to go next. A chiming sound, though. We want to keep that in mind. Diamond Shield. Uh, the diamond equipment resists lightning, supposedly. I have to wonder though, why are the mermaids holding on to this bunch of money, by the way? And all this equipment. This loops around over here. Diamond helm, diamond gloves, and the Rosetta Stone. Lovely key items. I'm going to try out this teleport. Save me a little bit of time. Now we have to go downstairs. No treasure in this area. I thought there would be something in there. There's something in here, though. It's just more pocket change, but that's always handy. There is treasure in this area now. If I go this way... I'll meet a new enemy! The Ghost! Which are pretty much the strongest of this variant you'll see. Well, in the main game, that is. They are extremely powerful, and they used to be extremely quick, but not this time. Pocket change. The Giant's Gloves. The Giant's Gloves can be used as an item of to cast Saber. A second light axe, for some reason. Uh... Well, first things first, I forgot a treasure room. So let's teleport back. Yeah, this room. The main reason to come in here is for the ribbon. Now let's go back down. This floor has no treasure. It's also the final floor.
Almost there. And here we are. It's now time to fight the Fiend of Water, Crockin, who is looking very distinguished in his cape and mantle there. Let's make use of the Giant's Gloves there. And cast Haste with the Ninja. waiting for the game to make up its mind there. Cast haste on the ninja. Yeah, the Kraken's physical attack can be stronger than Marlith sometimes. If you're lucky, he might use ink, which is pretty ineffective. As you might expect, Kraken is weak to lightning. And he's probably not going to last too long as a boss. Crockett means business today. And down he goes. And we now relight the Crystal of Water. One thing to note about Crockett in that battle is that he has the chance to drop a Kikuichi Manje sword. Well, Katana. For the ninja. I wouldn't try for it though, it's not worth the effort. And the Life Spring Grotto is now open for business. I don't really need to cast Exit, although I probably should have. And we are outside. But will I be able to climb the Mirage Tower? Find out another time. I'll see you there. Take care now.